Automatrix M track recovery operation, Friday the 9th of October 2015. We've had an alarm from a static caravan this morning that's indicated it's been illegally moved from site. The device was installed in this caravan over five years ago in August 2010. It's a battery powered tracker, so the battery's doing quite well to last this long. It's on a special setting and uh, hopefully we'll recover this today. We've had 14 stolen statics recovered in the last three years, so they are an at-risk item. And actually, this is our second one this week, so something's really hot on static caravans this week. We're, we're heading towards Ashford, just south of Ashford, Kent, to make a RF recovery find, and hopefully pick up the signal when we get there. It's an industrial estate here and the, we think the caravan's in there but I'm just picking up on this sign here it actually says caravan sales all right so what I'm gonna have to do now is um, pull up here and wait for the police and then go in with the police to see where this caravan is So, stolen caravans inside this yard and we've got to wait for the owner to come and unlock it. And because it's on private property, um, they're going to be have to be answering some questions. So this is a stolen static caravan. It's in a, in a, just basically in a yard full of other ones up for sale. East Sussex police have arrived and we've got a recovery operation now in progress with the stolen caravan going on the back of this truck and we'll take it to a safe compound for the customer. <laughs> Works though, doesn't it? I say it's the 14th one we've got in three years, 14th recovery. Yeah, they'll counter it though one day, won't they, and learn how to find them? They can't scan it. Our, our ones are dormant, so you can't scan them for anything. They're not wired in, you see, so they're not live. They only go live when they detect unusual movement, so they're pretty high tech. <laughs> 